in this channel, we have a tradition where I suit up for the season finale, but still no pants, and you know why? Okay, this is a hobby, not a job. Let's begin. That's right. Alice got depressed and left. Alice ran away from home? <coughs> Jesus. You ever like swallow spit accidentally wrong? <coughs> that just happened to me. <coughs> Alice. Alice? Not Alice. Kikuka. Mailman. Random mailman. Maybe Alice is in there. Alice is in the large package box. What is this? Rath sent us a package? Alice. Yo! The blonde girl. It is. Is that literally Alice? That's a fucking human vessel, I think. He just sent Alice to his ship box. <laughs> what? Oh god. And she naked. Pull me out, big bro. Pull me out, big bro. What are you doing, Alice? Is that a battery for her? Where does the battery go? Not in her butthole. Okay, it's 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 somewhere up here in the back. Okay, she's a she's charging.逃げ出すようなまねをして申し訳ないと思っています。しかし私、ですフレンド。どうしても本物の体を持つキリトと二人きりで向き合い、言葉を交わしたかっているのです。ファクトライド。なぜあの時言ってくれなかるかも知れない
The dojo. The more I think about it, like, dude, Kirito's family is so rich. Like, is this our property? Where is the dojo? How does this work? Is it by our house or is it like a separate place that we don't own and we just happen to visit? It's like an empty dojo that we visit. Because is this our property? Do we just have a fucking private dojo? How does that work? They own it? Dude, look at the fucking land. It's in our house. It's our property, right? Holy shit. Dude, look at this. Look at the garden. Look at the garden here. They have a fucking little pond. And then a separate dojo. Dude, their family is unbelievably rich. Asuna is very rich, yes. Dojo. <laughs> I love how she always, the left hand goes to where the sword would usually be. Right? That hand is always there. Night role play. System core. <laughs> Fucking enhanced armament. Say it. Say it, Alice. Let's see if it works here. You want to spar? Well, I mean, after <laughs> ordinary skill, Kirito it can actually spar <laughs> in real life. Yeah, no need to hold back because you're fucking steel robot. Kirito should be the one saying fucking that. Oh, that pose. This is the northern something form. It's the one that Volo uses, right? The NorCal, I forget. And then this is the stance that we do to counter. I remember this. It's always this countered by the low stance combo attack. Norkian, yeah. Mm, when she was under the tree. Oh, they broke. Kiss, 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 kiss. It's gonna happen. They both broke at the same time. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, you hear that? Steel. Ouch. Kirito might have gotten concussed there. Oh, she's on top of him though. Yo, Sugu, now show up and get cucked. Where's Sugu at? Sugu should show up any moment and defuse the situation before it gets too heated. <laughs> Steel headbutt. Secret skill. Sure, you planned it. Oh! oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Yo, that was so close! I thought she was going in! Holy shit! What's your calling? Now, Sugu? Sugu now? Yeah, Sugu. Yo, full family! Dad and mom! Very rare that we see mom, but dad is here too? Holy hello, Kirito dad? That's him right there! His ass never shows up. Finally, the whole family is here. He, look, he looks very stern. Very serious. Is it a dad? <laughs> what? It's an uncle? Oyashi, Kasan. I mean, he says dad and mom, but I guess there's like Kirito lore, huh? I actually have no clue about Kirito lore. I have like no fucking clue about Kirito lore. I forgot. Yeah, Sugu's parents, adopted, cousin, but good enough to for Alabama ass, yeah. True. AGI kind of through Alice. Did they ever go into depth of how Kirito's parents were killed? Not just like a generic accident? Did they ever touch on that subject? Maybe during ALO, right? Like in the beginning of ALO, part 2 of season 1, maybe they briefly mentioned it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so distracted right now. I'm just looking at this fucking blender. 
of thinking how many smoothies I can make. Crash. You have no idea how much stress she was under while you were missing. What is my calling? I'm a swordsman, Dad. Fuck school. And then what? Bro, we've already helped, you know, fucking create AGI here. Like, fuck school, man. What's college gonna do? We already have all the insider information, like networking. Like we can get a job probably at Wrath easily. Like, like we do not need this, bro. There's no point to go to school at this point. America. Man, at this point, I really wanted a 200-year-old Kirito to be here rather than the memories to be wiped. Cause like, imagine what that sage like. Omnipotent 200 year old Kirito would say here. <laughs> and just full dead voice. Cause like when that Kirito was talking last episode, I got chills. Like that dude is scary. Honestly, Eren Jaeger levels of scary. You know how Eren went through a huge transformation from like season three and four? Like that's how I see Kirito. Like he's scaring me, man. <laughs> Toto, hey, that's where Team Wrath went, right? All right, we're the Oceanic Resource Exploration and Research Institution. Sure, but technically it's... Oh, what a bullshit title, bro. It's Wrath, but like the way that they're, they named their company seems so like nice and wholesome. What, Alice? You're happy that we'll be spending more time together if we get a job there? Oto-sama? There's the cuck scene. I was waiting for Sigurd to get cucked at some point. Here it is. Did you see Sigurd's reaction? Otosama? Excuse me? Ooh. I'm sorry, Sigurd. <laughs> yeah, I heard that sucks. Did he? Did he? Did he? Did he? How much of that a mom knows how shit works in simulation about the swordsman shit and stuff? Like, how, like, do they understand what Alice is talking about right now? Because, like, Alice is like, Kirito's the strongest swordsman I've ever seen. <laughs> Just a game, girl. You need to go get a fucking job, Alice. Oh! That a mom knows? Oh, Kuro no Kenshi. Black swordsman, you're <laughs> kind of chuny, kind of cringe IRL, right? <laughs> Damn, I'm not in front of the guests. Yeah, I guess these are important times. Great parents. That was nice. Even though they're not directly Kirito's parents, to get more like of them, because we've only seen mom behind the scenes but never get any dialogue. Actually, mom didn't talk for shit there. It was all dad, but hey. Go get a fucking job, Black Swordsman. Oh, Sugu or Alice? I think it's Sugu's hair. It looks short? Kirito. No, it's Alice. What's she wearing? Oh, casual t shirt. What's up? <laughs> what? <laughs> Barging into a room with just t shirt Oh, it's not just the T-shirt. There's nothing else down there. I see. So when they were making this robot design at Wrath, there was at some point during the decision-making process of how are we going to create her coochie. Should it look like this? Should it look like that? Like, like, how, how, cause how did that all go happen? You know what I mean? It's like, we need to model after Alice, like everything from like, just like hair, eye to fucking genital must match. Like, <laughs> this is crazy. 3am. Communication alert. Uh oh. Network, internet. It's showtime! Poo, right now. Vasago escapes somehow. Email is it's showtime. 
All right. Did she just do that on command? Did she, did she, did she just like print that? She like sent the file over networking. Beep boop beep boop print drop. It's pretty cool. Climb the white tower and ye shall reach unto yon world. Training underscore hall underscore number two dot media storage dot senate dot geographical underscore records underscore room. Okay. The white tower? Axiom tower? The integrity church? Shit. AR? Yui. Ogma, baby. So Alice doesn't need Ogma to converse with Yui. That's pretty cool. Okay, everything is just built into her. Is it? Okay. And what does it lead to? That world. Underworld? Okay. There's a path to the underworld. Who made this shit? I guess so. The goal was take Alice out of the underworld and now it's take Alice back into the underworld? Who sent this shit? Kaiba? Kika? Rinko? I don't know. Because, like, last episode, we did talk about a path, right? Because Higa and old Kirito, they were talking about, like, a potential to protect the underworld and, like, how an existing server can like, still exist or some shit, right? Even though there's, like, limited resources. But, yeah, this is the connection there from last episode. <laughs> Her eyebrow twitched. It was a. Like, I saw that. Look at the eyebrow twitch, bro. Look, look. Boom. Uh, I suppose so. <laughs> Send Asuna to the front lines. Let her die. Yes, we need cannon fodder after all. Oh my god, Alice. <laughs> Here we got no clue. Rinko. My setup. He's involved. Kayaba? Higa. Kayaba? Higa. Akiko Kayaba. I want to believe it's Kayaba. Fuck it. A firewall? Oh no! Asna's here! STL! Oh, hey! Two hundred years has passed, so do you think Fanatio's children are already dead and there's like grandchildren? Same with like Shaita and Champion's kid if they ever had any. Because like how long do they live, right? Also, was it ever explained how Asuna and Kirito were able to live for 200 years? I thought that the durability would not last that long. Yet they existed in world for 200 years. How does the lifespan work? Because like Yushu didn't age that long, right? Or am I misunderstanding something of like... People in the underworld are aged very, very hundreds of hundreds of years. I don't know. Yeah, Quinella existed for 300 years after getting that fucking immortality shit, but... I don't know. Flags, flags. I bet a lot changed. Selka. Selka still exists after 200 years? Okay. Link start. Link start. What's it gonna look like now? Oh, dual wielding already. We're in space? We're in space. There's no underworld? SAO going into space? Where's the planet? Underworld? Stellar year 582. Is that Earth? What is this shit? Stellar year. There's a planet that looks like Earth. Golden light. Is that... That looks like the underworld, right? The four quadrants? Yes. The four quadrants with the central tower? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Am I already? Wait, wait, what is this? The dragon eggs, remember? Remember what happened? Both dragons got like reverted to their baby egg form. Oh. It listened. Okay, we're not we're no longer in the medieval ages. Okay, we're 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 really in the next space frontier, huh? Okay, no more knights and horses and dragons and shit. We going to fuck we got jet planes and shit, bro. What? <laughs> Integrity pilot, not integrity knight. We got integrity pilots, bro. Sticka. Sticka. Sticka is the name of Subaru and Rem's child, the daughter. It's named after a constellation as well, right? No, that was Spica. Spica, not Sticka. I'm not sure. Yeah, different names. Laura. Steve and Laura. Arabelle. It reminds me of Tisei and Roni right now, right? This person looks like Tisei and the other person looks like Roni. Sorry, the dialogue, the thrusters on your outfit should be enough to get you back to Cardina, where they came from? Roni! What are they fighting? <laughs> Mythic Space Beast, the Abyssal Horror. What the hell happened? What the hell happened, bro? <laughs> System call? Yeah, a dual wielding. Oh, he has the stupid OP power still. Look at this shit. It's the hack golden barrier wall still. Dual wielding. Yep. Swords, man. It still works. Nice guy blade now. Give Kiri to your powers! Whoa! That got huge! Asuna! Terraform! Damn, bitch! He's still OP as all hell! Holy shit! What the hell does that happen? Like... What? I'm still like baffled on what the hell's happening right now. Obviously, a lot of time has passed. Civilization has got to the space frontier. There's no more integrity knights, there's integrity pilots. There are these monsters that comes out of fucking nowhere. How did they just get created? Spontaneously? Was there external, uh, I don't know, involvement in creating these monsters? Kitty to announce now they can just exist in space because they're just god mode right now, but it's crazy, man. It's fucking, it's fucking crazy. And like this part, where did it come from? Asna literally terraformed, opened up a path, and the meteors dropped from the path and hit the monster and they all exploded together. Like, what in the fuck is going on, bro? The power scaling is insane. <laughs> what? Alice is here. Osmanthus. You do? You see that shit? At the top of the pilot, there's like a symbol. There's two swords here, so they know. And it's, it's the Osmanthus flowers as well. Yes, this is the Osmanthus flower buds. So the, the, the design of the, the fucking integrity pilot uh, air, aircraft, they are honoring Alice? There's two swords. Easy. The three gods. Steve. 
Roni, <laughs> so it sounds like Kirito Asuna analysts, these are all like legends in their education system, right? They're, it's just like their heroic tales has been passed down through centuries and they still worship them as like old gods or something. <laughs> Yuji always figures out a way to show up, bro. Like, it's kind of crazy. That this motherfucker been dead since season 3. But in season 4, he's shown up more than fucking Aikyo. Yujiro never goes away. He will always show up somehow. Tisei's great, 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 great granddaughter getting cucked right now. I want you to understand that. Honestly, I'm impressed that the space monster did not do some rapey shit with Tisei and Roni here in space. Because what do they do? They exist simply to get sexually assaulted and then for someone to come save them. Is there? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, what was this? There's like an actual passage here. Hold up. This seems actually kind of important. Yeah, this, this part's actually important. Look, 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 look. All stories have just been told. This is where the story ends. But Kirito Asuna, Lifa, Shinon, and others will join Alice in a battle beyond this point. So... If the space arc in Season 5 ever gets adapted, it's looking like this is what it's going to be. Space Wars. Space art online. Leaf and and others will join Alice in a battle beyond this point. They will next take up their swords in the final greatest battle of all. The Inter-Intelligence War. I said this is the final man. The final greatest battle of all. This is the true, true final arc of SAO. But as of this moment, every possibility is but a faint flicker. So, this is A1 Pictures letting us know. Listen, there could be Space Wars, yes. But, like, we don't know if we can animate it. So, like, it's a faint flicker. <laughs> As of this moment, it's not under production, right? So, hold, hold. Okay. Nimon? Is this Nimon? So, 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 what, what is this hinting at, right? Because remember, and, and Vasago mystery is still weird. Because remember, the craziest mystery is Vasago's body disappeared. But so did Niemon. At this point, underwater, Niemon's body is shown holding a cable, which I'm assuming he literally fucking made the server possible, right? Niemon somehow connected this shit, nuclear reactor power source, I don't fucking know. He made the server underworld possible is what I'm understanding here, right? Let's go, Kaiba. Look like... Something's getting ejected. Oh my god. Is that Kaiba literally coming back? It is, right? It's Kaiba. Not only has he fucking successfully connected the servers, I'm not really sure, but if that's, if maybe that's wrong, but this part, Kaiba's Flucklight? Kaiba's Flucklight's being ejected, just like Alice's. I don't know, this, this is Kaiba though, right? This has to be Kaiba. Because like, what else would it be? What, what Flucklight could this be at this moment? We know that Kirito has backup memory in there, but why would Kirito signal here? Wouldn't it make more sense that the blue color is Kaiba? Associated with the SAO pod colors as well? Why are you saying it's 200 years Kirito? We know he's already have a backup image in there. But Kaiba's Flucklight has not been out. I don't know. This could be like, um... Kirito and Kaiba kind of like resonating. But I feel like this is Kaiba. Did author any say anything about this part in the light novel? Because, like, it's not a kill. The blue color has to be related to the SAO pod, which is supposed to be Kaiba, right? I don't know. Could be Kirito or Kaiba, but it's not a kill life. Listen, that's the biggest mystery of all. Vasago's body disappearing is not the biggest mystery of SAO. It's a wife. Does she exist? Agil has been holding out until AGI so that he can fucking have an artificial wife and say that this is the real wife the entire time. He's been winning the entire fucking time. Kirito. Hmm. 
What could the imagery here mean? Because Kirito is like opening up some sort of doors, right? And looking back. Could it tie into this moment? As in this is Kirito here? I'm not sure if they're related, but I don't know. There's a, there's a lot of interpretation, right? Up to the mind right now, but that's pretty much it. Kirito will return. And ladies and gentlemen, that is Sword Art Online. Bro, when did we start season one? Straight up. Like, this is crazy. This might be a half a year project. Let's, let me just, hold up. Let's see. Sword Art Online, right? Sword Art. And if we check the date, bro, February 26th, 2024, February 26th is when we started SAO. This has actually been like half a year, right? This is the longest fucking shit we've done, man. We've taken our sweet time with this show and god damn, we're finally over and it's bittersweet. It's a bittersweet ending. Every day we had SAL and finally at a turtle space, you know, we finally got here and man, <sighs> sucks that the journey is ending, but it gives me hope that there's going to be future SAO content because of the inner intelligence war and Kirito will be back. But A1 Pictures said, ah, we don't really know of, you know, whether that's going to happen, but one day. Season 5, I believe that it will happen. Sword Art Online. This season 4, 5, season 3, 4 together, it was so good. Minimum 8 out of 10. Plenty of arguments to be rated higher than that, but minimum 8 out of 10. The hate for SAO is so overblown. If people actually saw SAO beyond the shitty shit that they saw in maybe ALO, and... Maybe people didn't like the slow parts of Mother's Rosario and Tonki stuff, but like genuinely, there is little to hate about SAO other than my, my biggest gripe is the sexual assault online memes. Because clearly, Reki Kawahara, him and apparently the director of A1 Pictures, they love doing creepy shit together, and the Leafa scenes were the product of that. But <coughs> I'm sorry. But if you look beyond that, like the whole sci fi AI, I think that the way they handle the futuristic technology, of like VR, AR, and like AI, and whether or not they have rights in AGI. It's fascinating. It's amazing. You could truly see that this is going to be your future. SAO has been such a fucking delight to watch. And I thank you for sticking me to the end of the journey. And that's it, man. Who knows what we'll do from here on out? Probably Fate Series. And when Season 5 comes out, we will be there to farm it. And until next time, take care.